Hello, everyone, and thank you for coming back to watch our channel. I'm sorry to say that I have some disappointing news for you today. Nick Curdiels, a former forward for the Anaheim Ducks who made history by becoming the franchise's first player from Orange County, passed away in a tragic accident on this day, and the hockey community is mourning his passing. After being involved in a motorbike accident in Nashville, Tennessee on Saturday, September 23, Curdiels, who was only 29 years old, tragically lost his life and went away. At approximately 3.30 in the morning, Curdiles was riding his motorcycle when he allegedly disregarded a stop sign, collided with the side of a BMW vehicle, and then fled the scene. He sustained severe wounds and was transported to a local hospital, but he was pronounced dead shortly after he arrived at the facility. Curdiles was born in Louisville, Texas, on January 11, 1994, but he relocated to Irvine, California, with his family when he was just two years old. He currently resides in Irvine. At the age of six, he discovered that he had a talent for hockey and joined the Junior Ducks program, in which he went on to achieve great success as a player. He participated in the United States National Development Team program while he was a student at Servite High School. After that, he moved on to play ice hockey at the collegiate level for the University of Wisconsin, where he was a vital contributor to the program's 2013 WCHA championship victory. As a result of the Anaheim Ducks selecting him in the second round of the 2012 NHL entry draft, he became the first player from Orange County to be chosen by the franchise. This achievement allowed him to realize a desire he had since he was a child. In 2017, he made his debut in the National Hockey League with the Ducks and appeared in four games for them. During his time in the NHL, he was a member of several different teams, including the San Diego Gulls, the Winnipeg Jets, and the Manitoba Moose. On the ice, he was renowned for his swiftness as well as his talent and versatility. In addition, Curdiles was famous for his relationship with the reality television personality, Savannah Chrisley, who was a participant on the shows Chrisley Knows Best and Growing Up Chrisley. In 2017, the couple first connected on Instagram and immediately hit it off with one another. After Curdiles meticulously planned a sweet and romantic proposal on Christmas Eve of 2018, the couple announced their engagement the next day. However, in 2020, they came to the conclusion that they should break off their engagement because they were still too young and needed more time to develop themselves. They maintained their friendship and were there for each other through the highs and lows of their lives. Chris Lee posted on Instagram that she was heartbroken and that heaven gained the most beautiful angel after learning of Kurdal's passing. In addition to that, she shared some pictures and videos of the two of them having a good time together. Curdiles is survived by his parents, Michael and Natalie, who were born in France, his sister, Marine, who works as a nurse, his brother, Kevin, who is also a hockey player, and his dog, Willow, who was a devoted companion to him throughout his life. On top of that, he is remembered by his former teammates, coaches, fans, and friends, all of whom have taken to social media to express their condolences and pay tribute to him. Those who were fortunate enough to know Curdiles were quick to point out his kind soul, great teammate, and wonderful person qualities. He left a positive impression on everyone he met, and through his generosity and kindness, he touched the lives of a great number of people. Everyone who knew and loved him will grieve his passing deeply. Nick Curdiles, may you finally rest in peace. Also, if you have any ideas for videos that I should do in the future, please don't hesitate to send them my way. I sincerely appreciate you taking the time to watch, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.